So green screen effects is a way to take your production to the next level. A lot of people want to get into green screen effects, but they believe it's too complicated. Uh, it's too costly. You have to have a professional DSLR or mirrorless camera. You have to have professional lighting. You have all, everything that you need has to be professional. And I'm gonna tell you, that's not the case. What you're looking at right now is coming from a $160 phone. Yes, this part of the green screen effects that I'm showing you right now is coming from a $160 phone. Not only that, the audio that you're listening to right now is coming from that $160 phone. All right, so let me show you. Here it is. This is the green screen. This is my DSLR mirrorless camera. Also with the audio, what you're listening to right now is my professional DSLR uh, and uh, looking at me and you see that the, the green screen behind me. And it's so weird that a lot of people believe that you have to have a high-end professional gear to do green screen effects. That's not the case. So in this video, I'm going to give you a tutorial on how to use the phone in your pocket, the phone in your pocket to do green screen effects to bring, bring your production level to the next level. So sit back and relax and get your popcorn ready and follow me on this journey. Let's go. What's up guys, this is Eric back with another video. So look at this, look at this green screen effect, right? I'm able to change my background. I'm able to do all kinds of different things. I could change the scenery. I could be in different places. I could be in different spots. And what you're looking at right now, is just a basic background, something you can Google, something you can get from story blocks, something very simple, very easy to do with the phone that you have in your pocket. You don't have to have a thousand dollar phone to do this. You don't have to have one of them high end. You have to make sure you have the best cameras on the planet to uh, phone to do this. You don't even, even need to have a professional DSLR or mirrorless camera to do this. Now the lighting that I have right here uh, is coming from 30, $35 lights, right? The Veltrax lights, which I will leave all that product links down in the description. So what you're looking at right here, it's a very simple green screen. We call it chroma key. If you're using Premiere Pro, it's called ultra key. It's very simple. So what you're looking at right here is very simple. But the hardest part that people get nervous about is when you get to the editing part. So what I'm going to do in this video is, as you can see, I'm in green screen effect, right? And let me get out of the green screen effect. And as you can see, I have a green screen here, but even though I have a professional green screen, you can use this with a green cloth, uh, $10 green cloth. They just pin it up and they, you can use it as your green screen effect. Also the lighting, 40 bucks, right? I would recommend get two lights, right? One on each side. The editing software that I use is Adobe Premiere Pro, but if you have a Mac, you can use Final Cut Pro, or you can use the phone. Most of your phones now with Adobe Rush, uh, all kinds of different uh, phone editing software has chroma key where you can chroma key yourself out. But in this video, I'm going to use Adobe Premiere Pro, which they use ultra key uh, to key out the background and change the background. Real simple, real easy to do. So let's go on and commence with the editing process. Let's go. I'm recording my screen. I got Adobe Premiere Pro open and you can use this with any video editing software that has chroma key. Now, and uh, Adobe Premiere Pro is called Ultra Key. All right, so here it is, right? This is the, the cell phone footage. Now, again, I use the new mobile G5, $160 phone to record uh, the phone part of the video. This is not the greatest camera phone out there. I use this phone to make a point. Not the best phone. Obviously, we got Galaxy phones and other kind of phones out there. All right, so let's do this. All right, so here it is, right? Um, I have my cell phone footage in there. As you can see, me with the 
uh, the green screen and I'm kind of, uh, you have to put all your files in your video editing software. You got to do that first. That's the, the first part about this. If you're doing green screen, you already know how to do editing. So I'm not gonna go through that. I've already done a video on how to do uh, Adobe Premiere Pro and other video editing software. All right, so the first thing we gotta do is we gotta chroma key myself out. Let's look at this. We gotta go to effects right here on the side. And uh, first let's crop. We need to crop myself out. Well, crop a little bit. And the reason why is because we don't wanna get that background in there. So I am cropping myself out here. All right, and right here. So this is the crop uh, factor. So I want to go left a little bit. You see that? I'm going to just drag in it uh, side to side. So about drag it about right here. And I want to go right. And as you can see, I'm dragging it right there. That's all I need. I don't need nothing else, right? You just want to get the whole green effect. That's all. All right. So uh, I did the crop part and uh, let's go to do the chroma key. Now again, in Adobe Premiere Pro, it's called ultra key, all right? So let's go to the chroma key myself out. All right, so I type in ultra and ultra key, you just drag it, drop it on the timeline on top of the file. And right here, the hourglass, you click that and you drag it to maybe the head part. You see that? Boom. Boom, so there it is. So half the green is gone. And the only thing you have to do is you got to do your modifications, all right? Uh, modifications in your green screen uh, is right here. So you kind of go have your drop down menu. You got transparency, highlight shadows and stuff like that. Your tolerance, kind of go tolerance a little, all the way to 100. Again, this is a cell phone footage. So you notice when I go tolerance all the way up, I'm getting a little red. I'm gonna I'm I'm fix some of that. Uh, and pedestal, let's go all the way out. All right, so right here, it looks like I have myself completely chroma keyed out, all right? Uh, even if I wanted to change some of the uh, other uh, cleanup, like that, you could uh, do a little choke here, kind of choke a little bit, and you could, you could play around with it, but uh, maybe about 20 on the choke level. All right, as you can see, I am totally out of whack because I got rid of all the green and by me getting rid of all the green, it, it, took, a, it took a lot out of me, out of my skin color. Again, $160 phone, you're not gonna get the best. All right, so I wanna go to my uh, temperature here because I, I need to add something to it. So I'm going 25 on my temperature, uh, negative 25 on my temperature. All right, and look, you have to play around with this, folks. I'm just doing this, but you have to play around with it. And I go to my tent. I did add a little stuff to my tent. See, I added a little green, added a little blue to my tent. Now I'm starting to look good here. I'm a little too bright, so I'm gonna take my exposure and I'm gonna dial that down by one. So now I'm getting a little darker there, which is fine. And then I'm gonna take my blacks. I'm gonna go just a little black, go a little darker on the blacks a little bit. All right, so look, again, this is a cell phone, so you're not gonna, a, a, a low end cheap cell phone, so you're not gonna get the best footage, but that's fine, no big deal. So when you chroma king yourself out, just add your background, and there it goes, right? Here it is, real simple, real easy. I just changed the background, chroma, seat, chroma key myself out, and I got a blue background. You saw part of that in the video. Let's take that out, right? That's easy, very easy. Let's go take Thanos. Y'all always see me using Thanos, right? So there go Thanos here. All right, so there go Thanos. But here's the problem. Thanos is green screen because I downloaded the green screen effect from uh, about Thanos, uh, which you could Google this, by the way. You could Google all the stuff that I'm doing. It's nothing special that I have. All you got to do is Google everything that I'm doing. So we got the chroma key out, Thanos. So let's chroma key Thanos out. All right, so I just uh, drag and drop my ultra key here and go to my control here. All right, let's go to my edits and hit the hourglass, tap. Now Thanos is black. That's fine. That's what we want. All right, and let's go to add a background in there. Right, now yeah, let's go with a, a, a nice little pretty background. All right, there we go. Now let's fix some of this stuff with editing, right? So I'm gonna move myself to the side right here. I want Thanos, I'm gonna put Thanos over here. I'm gonna make Thanos a little big though, right? 
So let me add a music track here. Since I moved Thanos to the side, I'm right here and add a music track here. I always use chosenbeats.club, my man Dan Tanner. Again, I made a complete video about all the music that I use on this YouTube channel. All right, so here it is, right? Oh, and I got to fix me, right? Uh, so I can start talking. And right here. So this, I made some mistakes. So let's go on and get me edit so I can start talking. All right. I got Thanos a little tall. Let's go uh, fix Thanos a little bit. All right. Uh, put him down a little bit. Okay. So I'm going to have Thanos dancing plus a background. Both of us chroma keyed out. And I got music in the background. But the music may be too loud. So let's lower the music down. Maybe about uh, level 27. Negative level 27. Here we go. There we go. Now, I got music playing in the background. I got two chroma keys going on and I have a, a background, right? There it is. So it's just that simple. It's nothing hard to it. All right, so when, when you're doing chroma key, it's nothing hard to it. And as you can see, I got Daniels dancing in the background, plus me, I'm, I'm here. And you can make your adjustments accordingly, right? Uh, I maybe was a little too tall, but there it is. Again, this was a $160 phone. So it's not a thousand dollar phone. You don't have the best cameras on the planet. So I, you got to do what you can with the equipment that you have. That's it. All right. That was easy. It was simple. Green screen effects is so simple. Don't make it complicated. Just sit down and do what you have to do and it will be all good. This is Eric Tech Preacher from Easy Computer Solutions. If you have any questions about chroma keying and, and doing green screen effects, leave it down below. I have a bunch of green screen videos to help you. That's what I do here. I wanna help. And everything that I did in this video was, I did it very simple, very easy. It took me maybe, 15, 20 minutes to do that, that intro and that middle part of that video before I came to the editing part of the video. Again, the phone is not the best, but I wanted to use this phone because I wanted to use the cheapest phone that I have that's good, that's made in 2020. The new mobile G5, 160 bucks, and I just did a professional chroma key video from a smartphone. That's what I'm talking about. Now the audio, the audio came, the beginning of the video came from the audio, from the cell phone, but I went to the professional microphones to finish the video. This is Eric. See you guys on the next video. Peace.